Hi, I'm Dr. Swachla, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. Today, I'm going to make a list of the reasons for irregular periods. If you fall under any of these categories, make a change in your lifestyle or if it's a medical condition, a clinical condition, consult your physician. I'm just listing out if you fall under any of these, you must definitely visit your dietitian or your physician or gynecologist depending on the condition. So the first and foremost thing, we're looking at some medical conditions. First is polycystic ovarian syndrome. Here, there is an imbalance of hormones especially the male hormones which are called as androgens due to which periods are irregular when these periods are irregular there is a weight gain tendency there is excessive hair on the face all these are indicative of PCOS but the biggest indication is that there could be irregular periods so PCOS is a big cause for irregular periods next is thyroid disorders this is also a medical condition a hyperactive thyroid or an underactive thyroid can cause irregular periods. Not just irregular period, it also insinuates that thyroid disorders can disrupt the balance of other hormones as well, such as follicle stimulating hormone, luteinizing hormone. All these hormones also can be disrupted because of a thyroid which is not functioning properly. Then comes stress. Physical or emotional stress can also lead to hormonal imbalance, hormonal disruption which could mean that you could suffer from irregular periods then is extreme exercise too much exercise could also lead to an imbalance of hormones which could directly result in irregular periods weight changes excessive weight gain or excessive weight loss can also cause irregular periods if you are falling in these categories where your weight is too much or you're underweight you must consult a clinician who will further direct you to a nutritionist then you should lose weight if you're overweight or gain weight and get the right kind of muscle mass and fat content in your body medical conditions such as diabetes can also cause irregular periods so if you are diabetic or pre-diabetic or your hb1c is imbalanced you must consult your physician your internal medicine specialist or your gynecologist who will then guide you to the right treatment protocol and then you can maintain your weight which can result in regular periods then birth control if you are on contraceptives if you are trying to postpone pregnancy or not wanting to get pregnant right now and you are on birth control pills remember your periods will be regular as well if there are uterine or ovarian issues such as endometriosis or polyps or fibroids present in the uterus or there are endometriomas which are nothing but uh, cysts which are full of endometriotic fluid then also your periods can be irregular which is why you must consult a gynecologist to regularize this condition. If you are perimenopausal, if you are someone who is close to the age of menopause, not there yet but you are close, your periods will first become irregular and slowly dwindle away and stop and you get into something called as menopause. So if you are around that time, consulting a gynecologist will cause no harm. She will test your uterus and she will look at your history and come to the conclusion whether you are perimenopausal or there are some uterine concerns that need to be addressed. If you are breastfeeding, also you could have irregular periods. Some infections that affect the reproductive organs can also cause irregular periods. If you come under these list of reasons for irregular periods and you wish to regularize your periods either to try for pregnancy or for a healthy lifestyle, please feel free to contact us. Thank you. A lot of effort has gone into making this video. Please like and subscribe us. Thank you.